Hello, my name is Revilson Fernandez, proudly representing WWF Philippines as their national ambassador. We're here now in Tacloban City. As you all know, Tacloban has been in the news globally for all the wrong reasons. It was hit by a devastating, uh, one of the most, if not the most devastating typhoon ever recorded and of course to hit land. Uh, the devastation, well of course we'll start with the lives lost, approximately 10,000 at first was the estimate and as the body count and missing persons continues to rise, well of course that number is very real. Economically, there was approximately 500 billion pesos in damage, agriculturally and of course structurally. Uh, what happened to you during Typhoon Yolanda? Doon yung bahay namin, yung umpisa, yung dating bahay namin nandoon sa gilid, doon sa may tuhungan namin. Hindi namin naman alam nga may tubig, hindi namin agad yung mga bangka namin. Wala na kaming inisip ngayon na bangka, basta ang importante namin, yung pamilya namin, mm -hmm. na mailisan agad sa evacuation. Tell us how important uh, yung bangka is to your family. Yun ang importante sa bangka kasi yung doon lang ako ang hanap buhay ko. Yun lang ang paghahanap ko. Marunong naman ako ng ibang trabaho, ayaw ko kasi may mga amo. WWF Philippines, we're here to hopefully start up this wonderful campaign. It's called Bangkas for the Philippines and uh, help the local fishermen in regaining their livelihood. Our initial response, uh, this is our first day here. Well, despite all the devastation and death, the Filipinos continue to, to, to move on. Uh, the city is alive and kicking, so to speak. And uh, it just shows the resiliency that the whole world saw of the Filipino and uh, it's something I'm very proud of. here in the town of Dulag. It's approximately 40 minutes from Tacloban City, an area also very hard hit by Typhoon Yolanda. Well, this is it. This is Bankas for the Philippines. This is where we're teaching local fishermen how to build fiberglass boats. Uh, the fiberglass boats, of course, are a means in providing daily sustenance for their families. It gives them back their dignity, and more important, we get them back on their feet. Now, why fiberglass? Well, we consider it a wonderful material. Uh, we call it climate smart. It's very light, it's extremely durable, and it's very fast. You can build a fiberglass boat within a day or two. More importantly, we become less reliant on natural resources such as wood. Now, as the saying goes, you can give a man a fish and feed him for a day, but you can help a man build a fiberglass boat and feed him for a lifetime. And of course, thank you to all the individual generous donors who've supported Bankas for the Philippines. Thank you very much.